Supply chain management is an essential component of the healthcare delivery system. Health experts say it ensures that quality medicines and other health products are available at health facilities at all times. But they have also identified a weakness in the supply chain of products, hence a retreat was put together to pave way for easy access. Minister of Health Isaac Adewale admitted that an efficient and integrated supply chain system would boost the health system. And 50% of these resources will go into commodities. And that's why this meeting is very important. You will wonder, why are we investing in integrated supply chain management system? Because that is the backbone, as I've said, of an efficient health system. Without supply, there's, there's no health system. People will go there and say, oh, that they had no drugs. In fact, nothing stains a healthcare system more than the heart of stock syndrome. And when you have an efficient and integrated supply chain system, there will be nothing like out of stock. There will be nothing like it has expired. There is nothing like go and buy outside, which sometimes do happen currently. To address the constraints and the inefficiencies of the Nigerian Supply Integrated Chain Project, at the Nigerian Supply Integrated Chain Project, integration project was inaugurated jointly by the government of Nigeria and a consortium of international donors and partners to be specific global fund to fight AIDS, TB, and malaria, USAID, Gavi, UNFPA, Bill, and Melinda Gates Foundation. He, however, assured health workers and other Nigerians that the ministry will implement all necessary reforms to improve warehousing and distribution. The ministry must not face fail to share, share our challenges in the midst of this modest achievement. And these challenges must be addressed if we want to sustain the progress that we have made. These challenges include inadequate human resources, slow pace of cross-program integration, funding constraints, and inadequate infrastructure, particularly at the local government level. May I also state clearly the federal government of Nigeria takes supply chain management at the PAC level seriously, as it will be very critical to the successful implementation of the revitalization agenda of the PACs in the country. Stakeholders in the sector, for their part, spoke on the need to ensure availability of quality medicines in facilities. They noted that without the right medicines, health facilities are of no use. In their states, so that patients will get their drugs as they need it in good quality. And in, and, and in the amount they need it, no matter how remote their locations may be. You may wish to know that any hospital treatment without medicine is only ordinary counseling. You treat illnesses with medicines. And those medicines must be of good quality and must be available at all times. So here we are more concerned with the medicines used for the public health, like medicines for HIV, malaria, TB, um, reproductive health, and others. Uh, we need to strengthen the coordination, especially to cascade down to the local government, and that is very important. The primary health care uh, is the fulcrum of uh, service delivery, and that needs to be strengthened. So we want to make sure that uh, commodities reach uh, the facilities at that level, and that is uh, the push that we're going to do now. The other thing is the, we are integrating uh, the partner support that we have in the state through the Partners Forum. We have a number of partners that are partnering with us in health care delivery in the state, also strengthen the system. And we want to make sure that we maximize on the resources that are available through integrated kind of approach, uh, not only in terms of uh, 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 the commodities reaching but also in terms of the system strengthening, and that is uh, what we intend to do. They are convinced that the supply chain management will prevent out-of-stock syndrome in health facilities around the country and reduce losses due to expiration, thefts or damages. Chinamso Amadi, PTV News, Abuja.